I've loved Western Montana ecosystems since I first got to the University of Montana as an undergraduate. Restoring diverse plant and animal communities to MPG Ranch is going to require replacing areas that have been planted with exotic forage grasses with native plant communities. It will also require fighting weed invasions and reclaiming weed invaded sites with competitive communities of native plants. We also have observed about a 25% increase per year in the elk population. This year we've seen as many as 426 elk on the ranch. As those numbers increase, there will be a lot of pressure on the plant communities to support this growing number of, of elk. Our primary tool for restoration of lands are actually the plant communities themselves. The end goal is a, a functional plant community and the means to get there is probably selection of appropriate species to establish uh, uh, trajectories towards our final goals. So I think something interesting about soil science is that most people just think of it as dirt but really there's a whole world below ground and with soil microbes and mesofauna and that is often not considered and it has tremendous impact on how plants grow and how they interact with each other. We like to say that plants don't have roots, they have mycorrhizae, which means that 90% of all plant species have fungi growing on the plant roots and they help them increase nutrient uptake and, and uh, protect them from pathogens and so really studying plants without studying mycorrhizae is really, what's the point? To be able to maintain that, that richness. I, I think the challenges we, we face in my line of research is to try to do as much as we can in the field. Um, right now we're limited by methods. So that has in the past forced us to do a lot of research in the greenhouse. What I love about my job and I, I, I feel so fortunate about is that I can split my time between field work and uh, being in front of a computer and being in the lab doing as well as in the greenhouse. So I feel like uh, it's, it's very varied um, and especially the privilege of being out on the ranch, you know, regardless of weather.